Hi there, here we are at the historic Wayside Inn. This place dates back all the way to 1716, originally known as the Old Howe Tavern, or put more simply, the Sudbury Tavern. It was Longfellow's famous poem, Tales of a Wayside Inn, that initially sparked Henry Ford's interest in the property, which he wound up purchasing in 1923, with the intention of making it a living history museum, actually. Uh, after purchasing the property, he brought a number of his very famous friends to this site, making it an international destination. Some of his friends included Calvin Coolidge, Charles Lindbergh, and Thomas Edison. Today, the inn is regarded as the oldest operating inn in the entire country, and is the site for many fairs, festivals, and antique shows. Here we are at the Martha Mary Chapel, one of six non-denominational churches built around the country by Henry and Clara Ford as tribute to their mothers, Martha and Mary. It was built using wood felled from the 1938 hurricane and has been the site of several Hollywood movies, most recently Ghosts of Girlfriends Past starring Jennifer Garner and Matthew McConaughey. Another part of the Wayside Inn is the Redstone Schoolhouse. Henry Ford moved it here from Sterling, Mass. in 1927. Most people believe that it's the inspiration behind the famous song, Mary Had a Little Lamb. Hi there, here we are at the Wayside Inn Grist Mill. This place was originally built as a museum by Henry Ford with construction beginning in 1924 and with it becoming fully operational on Thanksgiving Day in 1929. And then from 1952 until 1967, it was Pepperidge Farm that operated the mill, producing the flour and grain for their fine baked goods, and they would display the goods within the mill. And then from 1967 until 1969, it was the King Arthur Flour Company that was operating the mill. And even today, uh, it's still in operation, controlled by the Wayside Inn. They produce between 5 and 15 tons of flour annually and is used in all of their baked products and within their restaurant. And aside from just being a mill, this is also just a great place to bring the family, a uh, beautiful spot for a picnic and enjoy a lovely day.